I was going for the threes. I just found out that I reached 5,000 views. Thanks to you guys, I have reached 5,000 views. And so to celebrate it, I am going to be ranked. Well, not ranked. I'm going to be telling you, in my opinion, the most underrated and like forgotten Skylanders that nobody really cares about from SSA though from Spyro's Adventure so no Giants no Swap Wars no Superchargers and no Imagineers just SSA because I want to talk about more SSA since I finally got that game beat kind of but yeah so let's just go ahead and start with the first element first element is going to be air and in my opinion, Lightning Rod is the most underrated Air Skylander. And the reason is for that, I never really hear anyone, besides me and e I and Portal Master e shout out to him. Um, I'll link him in the, in the uh, description. And, um... Besides me and e -Rai, nobody else really talks about him. So, yeah. Because of me and e -Rai, we're keeping him alive. Because <laughs> he's our favorites. He's my favorite from the Alpha Mint. Uh, air. Did I just say Elf Element? I meant Air Element. He's my favorite from the Air Element. And he is e -Rai's favorite. Of all time. So, yeah. Because of me... And e we're keeping this man uh, not forgotten. Because <laughs> everyone else doesn't really talk about him. So that's why he's in this list. Um, Now going into tech. It's obvious that it's Drill Sergeant. I mean, how is it not Drill Sergeant? Nobody talks about Drill Sergeant. Well, yeah, actually, no, they do. People do talk about Drill Sergeant, but people don't really like him. I personally like him. I like him better than Drobot because Drobot only has one move that's actually really good. This man right here, he could be good for speed running, and he does pretty good damage if you go for the top half. I'm not a big fan of his bulldozing, but if you go for his... His uh, top path, it's really good. Where he, with the <laughs> drills. But yeah. His his gun is okay. I mean, it does no, no damage. But I mean, it's fine. And could have done a little bit more damage. Maybe, I don't know, 10 damage at least. But besides that, he's still really good. In my opinion, at least. Now going into magic. We are... I say Voodoo is the most underrated because besides like Skylander Gamer TV, I'll put him in the description as well. But besides him, I don't really hear anybody talk about Voodoo. At least not that much. Like I don't I don't hear anyone talk about Voodoo. I just think Voodoo is such a good Skylander. And such an underrated one that nobody really cares about. And that the fact he was a part of the Forgotten Eight until he got his Eons Elite, of course. So, yeah. That's why I say he's underrated. His moves are really good. His his main attack does good damage. Uh, his uh, trip wires, that does like 90 damage. It's so good. And he's just good. Underrated, but good. Now going into Undead. My favorite from the Undead element from SSA, Ghost Roaster. He is definitely the most underrated. Being a part of the Forgotten Eight, just like Voodoo. Uh, and having only one figure until Eon's Elite. But yeah, he's underrated. His chain does decent damage. It does like four, like I don't know, thirty to forty damage. And uh, his um, 
his special move where he can turn into a ghost and not get hurt at all. That is really good if you're doing like boss battles and they do tons of damage. Like if you're playing like, I don't know, Trap Team on Nightmare Mode and you're trying to fight Chompy Mage, that move is going to be really good for that. <laughs> and also his uh, other move, the skull where he becomes like Pac-Man and stuff like that. That move is really good too. It does good damage and uh, it, it, he that makes it good for speed running as well. So I mean, yeah, he's just underrated. Now going into Earth, we got Dino Ring. Okay, yeah, I don't like Dino Ring, but I do agree on how underrated he is. So, I mean, yeah. I do agree how underrated he is. I just wish I liked him a little bit more. I do like him. So far, on my, um, on my Skylanders recheck, he has been my favorite one that I played with for right now. I don't hate him, but I just don't like him. He's not the first one I would play. I would rather play Terrafin than him. And I'm not really a Terrafin guy either. I'm a prison break guy. I'm a prison boy. Okay. So I mean, yeah, I don't. I I do like his uh, boomerangs. They're pretty cool. They do decent damage. His uh was I think it's like a boomerang shield where he just throws them and they go around him. That's pretty good too. Uh, but. His special move, I can't, I can't deal with that. I don't think it's good at all. It's like really bad in my opinion because it's kind of hard to, uh, to like aim and stuff like that, and it doesn't really work that well. So, yeah, he's the most underrated for Earth. Going into life, we got Zook. Now that, now nah, that is not. That is, that is, that's obvious that he that he's the most underrated. I hear nobody talk about Zook, Zook most of the time. I I actually like Zook. I think all of the uh, life element Skylanders are really good. Except for Stealth Hill. But I think that's because I suck with her. So, yeah. But yeah, Zook. He's underrated. I love him. He's He's so good. I think he's my second favorite life from, from SSA. So, I mean, yeah, I like Zook. His primary is fine. His cactus slash, I think it's a marshmallow. Not marshmallow. Mushroom kind of wall. It's, it's fine. And his, um, him shooting up in the air and then dropping down. That's fine, too. All of his moves. All of his moves are fine. Going into water. We got. Lamb Shell. Now. I love Lamb Shell. He's actually my second favorite water. From from SSA. As you know. From my logo. Zap is my favorite from SSA of all time. So I mean. There's no doubt about that. But yeah. I like Lamb Shell. He's really good. He does good damage. His combos are fun. His, uh, pro uh not pro me. His special move where he does the, the, like, what he has when he's holding into the ground, it shocks them. That's, woo, that's nice. And his shoot, and then he has range as well. That's good too. So, yeah, I like him. Now, before we get into fire, here is a honorable mention. It's another one from the air element. You probably know, it's Warnado. Warnado is so underrated. No, people talk about him, but they only talk about him as in him being bad. I like Warnado. He's actually my second favorite air element. So, I mean... I don't know, I guess I'm just an under an underrated Skylander guy. I mean, literally, I put Lightning Rod and Warnado in here, and they're my favorites. So, that's kind of obvious. So, yeah. 
But yeah, I like his primary. It's fine. His tornado, it's fine too. It's pretty good actually. Because you get to shoot turtles and you you can also go into water with it. So I mean, yeah. And him summoning tornadoes, that's pretty good if you have like uh, guys that are able to get into get into it uh, chasing after you. So I mean, yeah, that's the honorable mention. Now going into f the for fire. This one should not be not obvious. This is so obvious how he's the most underrated. It's Sunburn, the Forgotten One. Now let me put that more into the camera. There we go. It's Sunburn, the the Forgotten One, the one who only has one figure, one, not any mo. The Forgotten One, Sunburn. It's obvious that I had to put him in the last because I mean he's so forgotten. I mean what? And you're looking at it. one figure and you're looking at it. it's so sad how he only has one figure I feel bad for him I feel like they should have made him an eons elite because they had a second uh, eons elite for fire and they should have put him there and for air I think Warnado or lightning rod should have gotten that gotten there Warnado lightning rod and sunburn should have been eons elite that's Facts. They should have. They deserve it. Just because they're forgotten. But yeah, his flamethrower, it's good. His teleportation, it's good. It's good to get out of places. His uh, Phoenix Dash, whatever, it's good. Still kind of weird that he can't fly, but pfft. I do like the Phoenix Dash though. So I mean, yeah, it's fine to me. But yeah, those are the. Underage slash forgotten Skylanders from SSA, in my opinion. Um, if you have different opinions, uh, go ahead and comment down below. Thank you all for 5,000 views on the channel. We got we got more than 5,000 views. I'm so thankful for every one of you for watching my videos and listening to my opinions. Because... I didn't think uh, my channel would get 5,000 views soon, this this early, early, because I started these Skylander stuff, like, I don't know, like a couple months ago, or no, like, like a month ago, less than a month ago, actually, like five weeks ago. I started this, this Skylander stuff five weeks ago, and we're already at 5,000 views. I can't thank you all enough for watching my videos and supporting me as y'all are. But that's the end of this video. Like I said, I'll put Portal Master, e and and uh, Skylander Gamer TV in the description. Y'all already know them because they're more popular than me, but I don't care. I'm going to put them in there since I mentioned them. And yeah... Come, like I said, comment down below your opinions on what's the un, like, unpopular from the SSA line. So, yeah, that's it for this video. Hope you like, subscribe, press the notification button so you never miss an upload. Share with your friends that you can join us in this adventure. And see you later, 43 years.